you are highly welcome so this is the part two of uh, the meeting you can go down in the video before this to listen to the part one of uh, the meeting if you have not listened to the part one of the meeting so let's start admit i think i'm true okay I can't sorry, hear you. the network has not been uh, easy so as i was saying i will need more of you in the there's no order and please sir please sir i want you to also add in your prayers that all these people saying all these things putting all these voice notes causing confusion here if what yes. they're saying is lies that god will visit his anger upon them to their fourth generation i also want you to add that part so that these people don't go scot-free now also mention my in fact sir i will want you to start mentioning names if yeah the network is terrible okay so um we'll take um the next question is is almost it's just past nine and uh, i want us to attend this day meeting uh, so that we will, we, we will balance um, the whole thing okay uh please minded heavenly minded heavenly you have the mic minded heavenly you have the mic roman roman you have the mic uh and uh uh this other person that your your this thing your profile is uh the year and is it the profile is not coming up well but i can see you here so you're also unmuted i think this is the person that forwarded them um, one of the voices so the three of you can go ahead ask your questions please can i can i, can I come up please this is roman hello yeah roman go ahead hello yeah good evening so much i want to appreciate god for your life and uh, you know we don't have people telling the truth all hard the way you do and i really appreciate this meeting tonight now i want to ask one question a very it has been bugging my mind for a long time what happened to uaag uas what happened to it do we still have that grant the grant that ken is a uh, is claiming to want to this boss now is it that same grant then number two i want to ask when did uaag became uaag stroke apgn then they have three signatures what happened then is it that there are some truths that are hidden there does ken still have the uaag fund or is partnering with these god boys and then he want to over he want to overload or be the lord of that grant i want i want some light to be shared on that on okay, that please your first question let me start from your first question please i say what happened to uaag us what we are hearing before is that there was a grant named uaag us we are no more hearing you okay. okay. okay, what on. happened to okay, that hold on, hold on. Yeah. let me let me answer that then you ask the next question okay <coughs> excuse me now it has been on social media pedal that lies that it was all grand pressure group that introduced uh that started saying that uh, apostle ken's name was in uh, the document and that document later metamorphosed into uaag and later on it metamorphosed into uaag uas i want to say that that is a lie it wasn't all grand pressure group that started it if you came for the um uh, what is it called the thanksgiving sadness after the screening exercise so were you were you there no, I wasn't there. I wasn't there. Oh, 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 oh. There's no how you can verify what I'm saying now. But of course, we have many people on this uh, platform because right now we have 546 participants in this meeting. And I'm sure one or two persons attended uh, the Thanksgiving ceremony. Now, in that, on that day of the Thanksgiving, when I first began, mounted the program to speak, there was a woman she intro he introduced. And in his speech, he said, that this was the first woman that called him and told him that his name was on the document yeah it was on the it was on the, the it was video i watched the video oh thank god that admin Ellis, you know admin Ellis is always lying according to them <laughs> <laughs> and you just confirm that this one is not <laughs> so it was not all grand pressure group it was that woman i don't want to mention her name now but the time will come when i'll start mentioning her name now because she's part of the problem we are having here She's part of the problem we are having in this grant ecosystem. I know her office. I know her person. I know her. Now, when this thing started, it met up first into the uh, uh, UAG grant. I was, in fact, if you ask our grant project, I was with them in one of the meetings in top rank hotel where we met with Apostle Ken. 
and in that meeting, he assured us that he is the right person that he is there. Then all the official people started doing investigation and investigation, and <coughs> actually, the whole investigation they were doing, nobody can say if these people they were meeting were planted, cannot say. But to meet this person as the person will go uh, and where he will go and come back and say, hey, he's supposed to cancel them that is there. And we all believed. Now, okay, and there was a day I personally, in the center, uh, the, the, the top rank of the, I asked him, sir, please, this was the initial stage when we started, when I have not started blowing my trumpet about your age. I said, sir, this is your thing. Have you seen this? He told me that he has a copy of, of the, this thing, but it's a very sensitive document. That he, already, he has seen it, his name is there. And that was when I started to my trumpet to anybody that cared to listen. Even if you don't care to listen, I will drag you to listen to me that Apostle Ken's name is there. Uh, you can notice how, how I've spoken I was those days. Now, I am saying this before God and before now. <laughs> I have said everything I have said before. Now, it was later on we started discovering that there was nothing like UAG Graham. UAS has its own unending story. Okay? UAS has its own unending story. That I don't want to go into. Okay? Because UAS started and the grant, 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 grant were pursuing it. But when we started noticing that there was no grant, then we now put in UAS. And the primary story came on board. Actually, that primary story, there are truths in it. There are truths in it. But not as it is being peddled in the grant ecosystem. Oh. And we started, you know, we started dab, dab, dabbling into false, falsehood unknown to us. Until it was when you, uh, uh, OGPGN now facilitated this one, now we are talking about. And when they asked them, who, who do you want? They say, Apostle Ken. They said, you trust him? And I say, yes. Then they have to bring him in and started profiling him. That was when UAS talked. UAA, you started, you started hearing UAA, G, A, G, P, G, N. UAA, G, P, G, N. But Apostle Ken got greedy. He became greedy. He obtained this, but he became too greedy that he, he did not want others to come in. There was a time, if I say these things, I don't know if I'll be uh, exposing some sensitive information or uh, some classified information. I think I will need to uh, ask some questions before I, I, I divulge some of the secrets. So let, let me just stop up here, please. Permit me not to go for that for now. So that it is well. Okay. Uh, so that, that was how that was how the marriage between UAG and APGN happened. I didn't get you. I mean, it was the AGPGN guys that now introduced <laughs> Apostle Ken. Was it to be the principal partner that they will follow him? Who is the who is the yoga in this arrangement? That's what I'm saying because uh, be, uh, uh, there's nowhere. Over here. Your voice is the network. Over. The, the network is very bad here. Are you hearing me now? Hello. Yeah, okay, go ahead. Uh -huh. I said what I was saying was that there have never been a time that Apostle Kel would say that he's working in tandem with these guys that he's talking as if he's still the uaag fund they want to this boss as if he's the master is the country director of this one because he's still calling himself country director up to this afternoon <laughs> so what i want to say is it the master is it the guy of this union what what is it what's the arrangement between them uh actually uh, i can hear your voice but it is cracking in a way that i can't make out what you're saying uh, but let me uh, uh, let me just say this uh, so that uh, I don't know some people might also come to ask their question. Uh, let me say this, even as he stands now, right now, uh, you can hear from his last voice notes that he did not add the word uh, country director of UAAG. He did not mention country director. He did not mention UAG. He just said this grant, this grant. And towards the end of his voice, he mentioned his name and wanted to say country director and he held himself. Go and listen to that voice note again. Now, begin to mm. ask yourself, begin to ask yourself, why didn't he introduce himself as a country director like before? Something happened. But that is discussion for another day. Thank you. God bless you. Let's have another person. Mm. Yes. Hello, house. Good evening, everybody. Yeah, good evening. 
Please, sir. Um, Admiral Liz, you when you started your uh, introduction, when you started speaking, you were telling us about um, how you met uh, Apostle Ken, blah, 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 concerning Joyce and Lovely. Sir, please, with all this write-up and all this brouhaha that is happening in Grand Community concerning this Joyce and Lovely, if you people are not me, I am tired of everything concerning that that right up and that woman there's no truth in fact there's no truth in that woman called joyce and lovely sir please is it not high time we know who this person is thank you sir okay um actually it's not as if we don't know who joyce lovely is we know who joyce lovely is but <laughs> the thing is uh uh there is an Igbo adage that says, "Ahu he ku, ahu he a robber. Ahu he ku a robber." And um, being interpreted, uh, let me try because I'm not too good in interpreting Igbo. Um, that if you see what is more than a yam ban, you know ban is where you tie your yams those days. If you see what is okay, no, if you see what is more than a farm, you will sell the ban. <coughs> If you see what is more than the farm, you sell your barn. Now, uh, if we start pursuing Joyce Lovely, we'll be pursuing shadows. We know who Joyce Lovely is. But the most important thing is the person that is sending Joyce Lovely. The person that is sending Joyce Lovely. It's just like a human being be being possessed by an evil spirit. And you use cane and tell the human being, hey, sit down, I will flog you. And you start flogging the person. And because of the pain, he sits down. Have you stopped the problem? The answer is no. But as a Christian, now, sorry to the Muslim uh, brethren. As a Christian, you lay hand and cast the demon out. Haven't you solved the problem? That is the situation with Joyce Lovely. It's not as if, we, I personally, it's not as if I don't know who Joyce Lovely is. But dealing with Joyce Lovely will not solve the problem. So we, we will let her be. The only unfortunate thing here is the masses that believe in her lies. It's just like ITO sin that has been a liar all his life. He has been a liar all his life. And he will still post something and some people will believe him. Joyce Lovely has not said one thing and it came to pass. Not one thing, one, one, okay, half. She has not said half something and it came to pass. But she will still write something and people will believe her. Don't you think that those people are on that course? Don't you think they are, those people are being manipulated? Okay, well, I can say it's poverty mentality anyway. Okay? So, a right-thinking human being, when they see just lovely post, they will ignore it. They will they will know that it's coming from the quarters. Okay, imagine as somebody as dirty as Osim. Apostle Ken will now pick Osim's uh, uh, voice, voice note and post it himself. Is that not an insult to him? To him? If it is my father, I'll tell him, sir, uh, this one, no, you know, be like you. This thing way you do, you know, even if I know if you tell him, daddy, what do you do bad? I tell him, daddy, this way you do, you know, be like you, you know, be like you. Let's call a spade a spade. So, thank you very much. Uh, the next person. All right, sir. Thank you. God bless you, sir. You're welcome. Yeah, the next person. Okay, uh, I will um, unmute um, Comrade Samuel. I wonder why the, these uh, food soldiers of uh, UAG are not raising their hands. They were here and they, they've run away. Uh, I'm also unmuting Blessed Dawn. I'm unmuting. Okay, go ahead, please. Go ahead. Hello, good evening. Yes, I can hear you. Okay, good evening. My name is Comrade yes. Samuel. Uh, okay. Um, can you hear me? Uh, hello, bless you. Go ahead. Go ahead. Should I go on? Yeah, go on, please. Go on, please. Okay. <laughs> um, my, my question goes like this. Uh, first of all, I want to thank God for for the gift of life then uh, my question goes like this please um, there is a lot of uh, talks here and there we actually want to know 
what when when actually when are we getting this disbursement? What if it is date or if it is time? Let us know. Other than next week, upper next week, and so on and so forth. Okay, if you were here when I started this meeting, I made uh, I made some uh, explanation on that on this question. Yes. <laughs> if you are in the platform where you are promised next week, next week, those people promising you next week, next week are people that have extorted the masses and are trying to calm the masses down. Now, let me tell you what, what happened. Let me tell you what happened when I was still supporting uh, UAG. There was a time one of the members of our grand pressure group of nigeria well not the ones we are we are hearing their voice now this ones i'm talking we, are, we don't hear their voice and i still have the phone conversation the recording i still have it here the person called me <laughs> I, I almost said something that would give an hint the person call, called me i was like uh somebody close to apostle ken wakama the person is just like number two uh told this person that he should tell me that i can bring in ngos any ngo i want that was doing registration I can bring in NGOs and uh, charge them 150,000 naira. but if i collect the 150,000 naira <coughs> and get the details of the ngo then i should remit 100,000 naira to them and keep 50,000 naira to myself and i told this uh, member of program pressure like i said not this current one no. i told the person i said see if this person is telling you to tell me this tell him that if i am collecting 150 i will remit 150 back to him if it is 100 let it be 100 i will remit 100 to him and i will keep my proof of payment for tomorrow and that was the end of the discussion nobody contacted me again now why am i saying this before i respond to you some of these people giving you two next week next week <laughs> excuse me some of these people giving you next week it is next week it is next week those people are people that had deals. I have seen somebody forward proof of payment of one million naira to me, paid to to. Let me, hey, Jesus Christ of Nazareth, hey, and it's one of these people troubling us. One million, naira. and I, I will tell you that he did not remit the exact money he collected. Probably he remitted only four hundred and took six hundred. Who knows how many people he collected from? now and all these people will be on his platform in his platform what do you expect this person to tell them that he does not know when this person he will tell them it's next week and next week come he tell them it's upper week and if he does not come he will tell them he is admin that is causing the delay ah he's at his own grand pressure writing petition is this person doing this thing is this person doing this? that is their system now i am able to talk because they have tried they have been looking for something to nail me they have tried try try you know they work now that does not mean that i did not collect money from people to register for uag like i said in my voice note and in the beginning that there was a time i i made an announcement in my platform gib and i told them please come anybody that want to do it people pay sixty sixty thousand naira and i remitted the same i have my proof of payment so if i did not remit the exact amount and i kept some for myself and it is much that if they ask me to pay back, I cannot pay back. What do you want me to do? I will keep lying to the people. So that is what is happening. And I will tell you, don't follow those people telling you it is next week. See, when the time is set, eh, you go know. You go know. Government, do they? Like, you go know. And okay. the time is almost the time is almost at hand. Okay. The, uh, is sir, for me to see. sir, can you hear me, sir? Yeah, go ahead. Thank you um i've heard what you said and i hope all we all here have heard what you said about that question <laughs> then my next question goes like this uh, you are saying uh, uh, there was there's some platform that i'm also into whatsapp group and all that they were saying something about uh, uh, apgn collecting list on the ground even even there is, to be specific now there is one that i'm into the man said agpgn people they gave, they sold him, or they they gave him <laughs> access to one, one group or something. No, what I'm saying is, I'm, I'm, is is true because I actually spoke to one of the <laughs> with one of the APGN guys, which is a uh, uh, Chris, the public secretary, and he said yes, 
Uh -huh. So you you were saying that it's only the people that uh, that came to verification they are safe. Then what of the list that the APG and now that are collecting are also collecting on the ground now that is going on right now. And those people now that are, they are selling it to the masses, each person one thousand, each person one thousand. I do not say APGN told them to okay, sell. Let me, let, me get, let, me, let me get let me get you correct. Let me get you correctly. You said you called Chris, the publicity secretary, and he said yes, yes they are collecting this. Yes. Well, this is this is what I have to say to you. Uh, Adminelis, the one I know is the one I will tell you. The one I don't know, I don't know. Okay. Uh, I am not there when you called the publicity secretary, and this is a public space. I will not hold brief for this uh, publicity secretary. Uh, by the time we post this voice note, he will hear it, and he will know what to do. If it is true, he knows. If it is not true, he knows. But from my own angle, I will tell you that I don't know anything about any list being collected. And I can also tell you that there are platforms being created by these mad dogs, these foot soldiers, bearing the name of Grand Pressure Group to deceive the masses you see one I, one of them i posted it here yesterday where they wrote um new dawn on all ground pressure group of nigeria and you saw the caliber of people that had means there and all they do there is to castigate all ground pressure group and so people are <coughs> people are also creating different groups to do things to that we implicate all ground pressure group that i know for sure but for this Chris phone, uh, I don't have his number. I have not spoken to him. I don't really know him in person. The person I know is Ostas Dawood and seldomly, the, 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 the German machine, he seldomly picks my call. That one don't be called again now. Um, 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 let me, yeah. since we are in public space, let me get to the record state before they will say that I have said. Now, let me repeat what I said. Are you hearing me? Go ahead. Now, I said i called chris to ask to make an inquiry if there is a list another list that they are collecting and he affirmed to me that yes there are, there are some lists that are given out to people he did not tell me that he sold it do you understand that he sold it your voice he is breaking not, i can't hear you he did not he did not in any way told me that they were selling slots he just told me that they are giving out slot to some <coughs> persons. Do you understand? Okay. Now, okay. now the person that collected the slot that is now selling to other to masses one thousand naira per account number. So I was really worried. That was why I had to go to the extent of calling and finding for the number of Mr. Chris. And that was why I asked him. He said yes that he know about the particular person that I am talking about. And yes, he gave them slot. Okay, so, but now you were saying that it is only the people that came for verification. Because to my, to the best of my knowledge, these people now they are, they said they are giving slot underground. They also came through the backyard. So I don't actually know. Uh, you know, this, this the the grand uh, community is full of deception. So we don't actually okay. know which one. Okay, okay, sir. Like, like I told you, like I told you that what I know is what I will say. The one I don't know, like you said, you called Chris. Was I there when you called Chris? No, 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 no. Okay, and if you tell me you called Chris and you are the only way I can be sure that you called Chris, if I make my investigation, call Chris and he says yes, that's when I will believe you because I don't believe anybody in the grand community unless I do okay. my investigation. That's what I'm saying. That okay. unless I make my findings, uh -huh. but for now, I will tell you what I know, and what I know is what I have said. I am not okay. saying you're a liar. And i am not saying you are saying the truth okay. get me right please yeah, yeah that is the way i do my things i i do my things based on the available facts in my fingertips i don't i don't do things on on hearsay okay okay no I, I hope i hope we are i hope we are even now yes yes yes, yes. Oh, okay okay thank you sir please the the next person yeah, good evening admin Ellie. <coughs> yeah, go ahead, please. Good evening, Admin Ellie. Yeah, good evening, sir. Go ahead, please. Yeah, my name is Blessed. Yeah, I have a question, and uh, one of my questions somebody just asked me. But let me start from uh, the time of uh, screening and verification. I spent two, two weeks, 14 days. At the screening 
and the verification. Automatically, I am not an NGO, but I work for two weeks. Then my question is this. From the on ground project group, they made us to know that the only money available as a grant in Nigeria is US money. That's why I said one of our questions. Somebody uh, asked me that question. Please, is, I, I didn't hear you. said any other money know. about They made yes, you to know that was a meeting. Yes, okay. yes, there was a meeting we are with all grand project group. And they said the only money that is available in Nigeria that even Tiobas and all these specific Mama Sprint, all of them have been fighting for is this same UAS, UAS, UAS money. Let us use the word US money. They, they said that during one of their meetings because I follow everything up. Then during the verification and screening, Arthur and Lawrence, Lawrence to be precise, was present even at the Thanksgiving because I was present at the Thanksgiving. And Lauren says something at the day of Thanksgiving. When you were asking people, did they know a lady that uh, called Apostle Ken and asked him if you know his name is on document? I know the lady, but there is no need of calling it on a public place because I was present. Then Lauren says something at that particular day. I said, this one that is coming to you is just a tip to know how capable you NGOs are. But if you eventually disappoint, automatically you cannot partake in the <laughs> next one. I don't know if you're getting me. Yes, yeah, I'm listening. Okay. And that person said, and the, the, first, the person that asked my question said, this particular money that is coming, is it UST, UAS money? Or there is another money? Then I followed this grant ecosystem for some time now i believe and i know that so many people <coughs> as of today is still talking about uax money that is even by the way my question is this i want to get it from you i am not a supporter of every other person anybody but my issue is every average nigerian today what we need is a lot in our account even if it's one one thousand everybody needs whosoever that is boss is not even important to anybody what everybody needs even you as you are if you dispose this money some people can take the glory even to their own father but what we need then is disbursement my question is this and this question is not only for myself this question is for entire Masses in Nigeria. Are you trying to tell us that this money is coming? Do you believe within you yourself? Do you know why I'm saying this? This is why I'm saying this is that I'm a psychologist. The lies in the grand ecosystem has been too much. Even <laughs> if anybody can come out now and say, I am sorry about that. Please, please, if please, anybody sir, can, can come out and say, can you go straight to your question so that we we save some time and have some people ask uh, their questions? Okay, okay, okay. Let me let me just go straight to the point. Do you within yourself? There is one evil name you give yourself. You you called your name the right. I couldn't remember, but uh, I would have loved to call you by that your name because that name will remind you about your village and where you come from. But let me ask my question. My question is this. Do you, Ellis, within yourself with all sincerity, believe that this money is coming? Even the time is not even important. Do you believe within yourself? Can you beat your chest and say, this money is coming to Nigerians? That's my question. <laughs> okay, uh, uh, thank you very much. Uh, let me start from your, you know, uh, the, the history you, you, you talked about UAS. Uh, if you listen to my previous voice notes, you will never hear me say UAS is a scam. No, you will never hear Adminelli say UAS is that. a scam. Okay, oh, thank God. But you will hear Adminelli say UAAG is a scam. Have you heard that, sir? No, I've heard. Yes, I've heard. I have. Okay, good. Good. And when I was talking about UAAG, UAS, I said that UAS has its own story 
to tell, but I don't want to go into that. I cut that place off. The reason is because okay. uh, um, there are some things I don't want to say here. This is in the open. And if I want to narrate the story of this UAS, uh, some classified information will be made, uh, will be declassified. And it, it may spell doom. It may spell doom for our expectations. And please forgive me not to go okay. into UAS. There is no problem with that. Yeah. <laughs> now, if the actor and whosoever you you, you call have did Lauren. they ever tell you that apostle ken's name was on the document there the, it, it, that uh, sorry that particular aspect i gave me now supposed to be a classified information but they were present at the screening venue hmm. yes they okay. were present even lawrence okay. lawrence was at the final at the, the thanksgiving lawrence was at the thanksgiving okay okay the, now, now, now i i understand <laughs> i understand where you're going uh Atto uh, started the screening from table one i screened Atto myself i was in table one not the table one i screened because Atto i saw you where you are oh thank god you saw me so now uh I saw for you. that let's 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 keep the uas uh aside let me answer your question your question is okay. and the name the name you don't want to call me is uche chuku uche chuku is my tribal uche name uche. i'm from Abia state yes. From ben the local government. That's what I wanted to call you. Yeah, I'm from other state from Ben the local government area. In fact, my from, from my local government to Apostle Ken's local government is just a stone, a stone true. So all these people call him brother, brother. I am more brother than those people. But one thing that Minelis will not do is to I fought during Teofat uh, Teobat. I exposed okay. your philosophy. In fact, the proof of payment that was used to put Tiobat in uh, ESCC cell, I provided it. Mm -hmm. It was through Google form link. People put it. There were many in number, but I was only able to download. In fact, I paid Google for the space because it was more than the free space. I had to pay Google with my money to give me space where I can save them. <coughs> when I downloaded those proof of payment, they we are 700. When I got to 700, the 700, the number 700 proof of payment, I stopped. I was tired. And I forwarded it to our grand pressure group. They printed it. So I fought Tiobat. Is that my brother? No. I fought Supreme. Of oh, you all know. It landed me to FCID. And I want to say this. God bless Dr. Nelson Obomodia. God bless you Dr. Have said Nelson. It before. Now, is supreme my sister the answer is no, no. <laughs> now if i have fought these two persons because i believe they are scamming the grand community and extorting the masses and it comes to somebody that is my brother will i keep quiet will i keep no. quiet i will i, I no, will no, be no, the no. most wicked person i some evil people called me and were, were like admin ladies you are fighting your brother I, and i i shunned them immediately and chased them away I shun them. My bro, if you are my brother, you should behave like my brother. I should be proud saying this is my brother. I, I anywhere I go, I should be able to say this or God, this now my brother, now my brother. I shouldn't be hiding it. If there is anything you are doing that will make me hide, why calling you a brother? Then that thing is not worth it. And I've been at this we fight it. To answer your question, I will beat my chest and I will tell you that there is money to be dispersed. Thank you. All right. Uh, sorry, before I go, Admin Ellis. Yes. Can you hear me? Yeah. Yes, let me let me let me add this before I go. Let me add this before I go. There is a chapter in the Bible that says your voice, that, your voice is breaking. Your voice is breaking. Can you hear me now? It's not as if I cannot hear you, but you, to make out what you are saying sometimes is difficult for me. Can you, can you hear me now? I can hear you very well. Can you hear me? Hello? Can you hear me? I can hear you very well. Can you hear me? Uh, see, your voice is breaking to the extent I can't make up what you're saying. I think what we should do is um, I will unlock the platform. You can drop your uh, your comment on the platform because you've taken well over five minutes okay, in your okay. question, and it's just one question. All right, answer all right, no. I, I hope I hope no I'm problem. Okay, with that. I'm 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 okay with that. Yes. 
Okay, thank you very much, sir. Please, the next person. <coughs> the next person. Minded Heavenly, please. Uh, Mr. Kunle, if you've not asked your question, please go ahead. Okay, Mr. Chukudi Solomon, you can ask your question, Mr. Chukudi Solomon. Yeah, I mean, I was, the, I was the man of God who told you that I don't talk, but I pray. <coughs> okay, good, good evening, Mr. Adminelli. Hi, your, your voice is, I don't know if the problem is from my end or I don't just know, but the voice is really breaking. Uh, can you hear me? Okay, yes, go ahead, please. Hello, good evening, can you hear me now? Yeah, go ahead, please. But, um, I want to appreciate the opportunity. I want to appreciate the opportunity you give me by speaking to Well, I don't have the question. But one thing I want to tell you, you are a friend and um, you are a brother. Uh, I want to tell you something. The Bible says, let your nay be nay and let your ye be ye. You are in the midst of different personalities and human beings. The Bible says the heart of man is death spiritually. Look at the adjective it used to qualify that heart. Death spiritually wicked. I want to admonish and i want to is an advice as a friend please don't ever say if you don't do this let this happen to you the devil is wicked and the people who serve the devil can take advantage because the bible has warned you not to do that and you are a child of god you're a christian please all what you have said i'm telling you is cancelled that if you if you are truthful or whatever God knows your heart. If you are truthful, the Lord will fight you. You don't need to put yourself under a curse. It's dangerous, please. You are a good friend that I want to always see. And Satan can take advantage of your good beating. And you see things happening. And you didn't do it. But because you invoke what you should not invoke. You, you went against God's word. Please. And that's what I just want to tell you. That's why I wanted to speak. <laughs> Everything you say, whatever you are, God knows your heart. Stand with whatever. Whoever believes you, it doesn't matter. Whoever that doesn't believe you, it doesn't matter. God knows you. And for AGPGN, for UAG, whoever that is wrong, God wants to do the matter. This is not us. Many of us have suffered in the hands of whoever that is there, but God fights this battle. It may be long. It may be now, but God will vindicate all our labor. And I don't want you to put yourself under those because Please, reverse all those things. They are not your portion. You will sleep you will wake up. You will see many more days. The Lord will do it for you. Don't worry about whatever that is going on. Let your truth stand for you. Don't mind whoever that wants to say it is a lie. It is normal. Don't because of anybody start putting cause upon yourself, please. Thank you. Uh, yeah, uh, thank you very much for that uh, advice. Uh, you see, the cause I put upon myself is also with a clause. And the clause is if what they say is lies let this not happen to me but if if it is true let it happen to me but uh, i actually understand your point that devil can take advantage of uh anything yeah uh, thank you for that uh, for that wonderful advice thank you god bless you uh please i will i will just give opportunity for two more persons and then we'll end this meeting i will uh, take in well over 41 minutes which is not supposed to be so <coughs> Uh, I actually, I actually thought that at least one of these uh, mad soldiers will come here and and, and uh, want to talk, so that I will give the masses opportunity to to ask bombard that person with question. Let me see how he is able to defend it. But uh, good thing they are they are wiser. They they quickly run run away. Okay, so <coughs> excuse me. Uh, I will give Haji, Haji Mazu, Haji Mazu, and she may see a favor. Please, the two of you, you can ask your question, then we close this meeting. And Joe, please, uh, Pastor, you can go on. 
uh, please for the rest uh, of the persons uh, raising their hands uh, I may not be able to call you to ask your questions but I would open the platform for your questions to be dropped there I may be able to respond to a few of them and uh, the rest you will know from the, as events unfold please pastor go ahead so go ahead yeah go ahead you are the last person please uh, good evening, everybody. Yeah, good evening. Good evening, everybody. Yeah, good evening. Uh, uh, my brother, I want to ask this. I know the question has been answered on and on and on and on. But I know you for one thing. You are never in a place that uh, there is a backwardness, or how will I put it? That is why I know you for that. You always wear everything is moving and moving on fine. So I want to for the last time. This is our money, my brother. You know, it has lingered for so, so long. It's many have lost interest in this. <laughs> so despite all what we are seeing this last uh, minute or last uh, time in this our grant, I want you to tell me by yourself, do we have hope? Is there hope for us? Is this grant available? Because if you tell me that it's available, I know it is. Uh, <laughs> I've said this. I think I've said this like uh, three or four times in this in this uh, meeting. I've, I've answered this question, but let me answer it again. Now, why do you think that everybody is fighting and dying because of who we dispose? Well, let me not say everybody actually, because. <laughs> there are some people that are not fighting for it and god just gave them freely they in fact they weren't expecting it but god gave them freely. and yes. the person that uh, actually got it on a platter of gold and because of greed he misused that opportunity and it was taken from him he's fighting to turn nail to get back in okay now the reason is, the reason is not just because of the grant uh i don't know how to say this without declassifying information the reason is not just <laughs> the reason is not just because of the grant the grant is there yes but there is much more than the grant okay that that is that is all I can okay do. that's why the all these fights is erupting from left and center front and back Oh, okay. Oh, uh, and, and, uh, I said, Baba, if you put Gida and Yusabi. I understand you, my brother. Thank you very much, Najisike. Oh, it is well with you. Yeah, Continue. thank you very much. Yeah, thank yeah, you very much. Wait. And yeah, with, with this last person, uh, I want to appreciate everyone that has stayed thus far in, in this meeting. Uh, it is not easy to uh, uh, keep yourself busy burning your data just to listen to admin Ellis. I have come a long way in the grant ecosystem. Uh, there are many things I have known and there are many opportunities to still come in. Many opportunities. By God's grace, the position God has, uh, you know, uh, led me to, my eyes are open to so many other things. <coughs> Excuse me. That is currently uh, something uh, on the pipeline. Uh, yeah, I'm involved, but uh, it's still on the pipeline. Uh, I, by God's grace, God will see us through and Nigerians will smile again. That is if, uh, that is if this grant is not, well, we, I don't pray for this grant to delay anyway. From all indication, it's, it's, almost, it's almost done. So, but there are lots of things on the pipeline coming. I want you to be steadfast. Don't forget to continue with what you are doing currently. If it is messing work, go ahead with your messing work. If it is carpentry work, go ahead with it. I admin Ellis, I'm not idle. And that is why you hardly can see me say, I, I, I'm in Abuja, I, I'm in Abuja. He, he, he come and no 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 the abuja i stayed i know how the money in fact <coughs> let me say this here the abuja i stayed 90 percent of the money was sponsored by a man in the grant ecosystem 
flight ticket, hotel bills, meal ticket, everything was paid by this man. The story is a long story, but it was uh, well, it's, it's, it's well. So I want to say a very big thank you to all of you listening. Uh, I pray that our expectations will never be cut short. I pray that we will live to not only test this grant, but also give testimonies and live to tell the story over and over again until we are 90, 100, 100 and something else, as the case may be. I wish to see you on the other side of the disbursement. Please, hang in there and hold on to whatever you're doing. I pray that God will continue to bless the works of our hands until this our coast is being enlarged in jesus name amen i wish you all a happy sunday